Okay, I got this question today on making a logo with a transparent background. It's uh, pretty much the same as the uh, signature watermark that I made a, a video earlier of, but I'll go ahead and do this for you guys. Uh, say you download a clip art off the internet, something like this, um, and you want to uh, make it a logo with the, the black being transparent. First thing you're going to do, you can't work on a background, so just double click on it, say OK. Now it's a working layer. Come over to your magic wand, select anything that's black in between the teeth and over here the P. We'll have to retype the data and I don't think it's going to work out very well. But um, without refining the edge and getting too fancy, we're just going to hold, go ahead and control X. It's going to get rid of that black background. And we're going to go ahead and wipe out this date. Control X as well. Let's go ahead and type in a date. All right. And for PC, Alt 0169 gives you the copyright symbol. 12. If it's a Mac, Alt plus G will give you that copyright symbol. Okay, now that we've got the date, everything ready to go. You double click on the layer, add a drop shadow. Now a little trick on drop shadows. You don't have to move the angle and distance. Just go with your uh, move tool and just put it wherever you want, really. It's quite simple. Um, Bevelin and Boss, give a little bit of that, give a little dimension, round it off a little bit. Okay. And I also noticed that we had something going on on these edges up here. There was some white in that, that clip art file. So we're just going to take the marquee tool with a, a zero feather and cut control X, control X on each side, just to get rid of any uh, stray, uh, stray items we don't want. There's nothing on this side. So we're pretty much done guys. Go ahead, file, save as, make sure you save as a PNG, very important. Call this Eric 2, and that's pretty much it. Just to show you how this is going to look on an image, I'll just open up one of my files here real quick. All right, and go here, open up the uh, logo, select uh, 2 up, and drag your logo onto your picture, and close that out. And you want to make it bigger, control T for transform, hit the shift to keep the aspect ratio the same. Say OK, accept, move tool V, put it wherever you want. Guys, hope you enjoyed this. Corey, this is for you. Thanks for watching.